all have a hunger for magic, which is why we all need our own unicorn, or at least unicorn-style decorations. And to start, here's what you can use a wooden basket for. Repaint it a mint color. When the paint is dry, take a stencil and a sheet of sticker paper. Attach the stencil to the paper. Cut out the unicorn. Glue it to the box like this. Coat the silhouette with universal glue and sprinkle it with glitter. When the glue is dry, remove the stencil. Next, make a golden inscription with a thin brush. Now, take a piece of gold foam paper. Cut stars out of it. Glue them on the tips of long skewers. Fill the basket with candies and decorate it with stars. How can you stay on a diet with such a beautiful treat basket? Or are unicorn candies zero calorie? A transparent umbrella is stylish, but a real unicorn fan needs something more special. Let's see what we can do. Take a piece of colorful foam paper. Cut out a pair of triangles for the ears. Next, another triangle. Fold it in a pyramid. Glue it. And wrap it in a gold braid in a spiral. Cut out black eyelashes. Decorate the umbrella. Place the ears on top and a horn on the top. Place the eyelashes in the center. Next, take some star-shaped confetti and glue them to the umbrella from the inside. That's much better! When is it supposed to rain today? This wonderful umbrella will keep my mood sunny no matter what! And now let's transform a wooden hanger. Repaint it. Make three multicolored hangers. Decorate them with cute stickers and sparkles. The sweeter the decoration is, the better. Also decorate each hanger with a matching bow. Done! Add a little magic to your closet. Done! For the next craft idea, you need a plate. Glue pink fluffy bangs to it. Cut out ears from a piece of colorful foam paper and fasten them next to the bangs. Decorate with roses. Next, cut out a blue triangle from sparkly blue foam paper and twist it into a cone. Glue it. Fill it with synthetic stuffing. Wind a gold cord around the cone in a spiral. Glue it to the center of the plate. Draw eyes with eyelashes using a permanent marker. What a cute jewelry dish! Place rings on the horn and put other jewelry on the plate. Useful and beautiful! For this craft, take a disposable plate. Draw a zigzag line in the middle of it with a permanent marker. Cut it! Now take a whole plate and glue the cut half to it like this. Draw bangs, ears, and eyes on the cut. Decorate the unicorn with bright colors. Make a couple of holes on the sides using a hole punch. Pass a ribbon through the holes and attach it. This mini pocket is so useful that you'll probably want to make more than one. They can hold so much! Who would have thought that unicorns love being organized? For this idea, you'll need multicolored pieces of foam paper. Cut out pieces like these. Glue them together. Make envelopes. Cut out a triangle from pink foam paper. Roll it up. Glue it. Fill the tube with stuffing. Seal the hole. Wrap the cone with a shiny ribbon in a spiral. Next, take strips of tulle and a plastic ring. Hot glue the strips to the ring. Wrap the tube with a piece of fabric and glue it so that the ribbon can move. Take some colorful tulle and glue it in the gaps between the white ribbons. Now take yellow ribbons and tie them to the ring like this. 
Glue the horn between them and ears on the sides. Hide the joints with felt and flowers. Tie a rope to the ring in a few places so you can hang it up. Hang up the canopy. This is a dream come true. It can be a place for reading and recreation. Or invite your friends and sit inside, dreaming about magic. And now we will tell you how to improve a gift bag. Make a few stencils out of paper. For the ears, the horn, and the eyelashes. Transfer the stencils to a piece of sparkly foam paper and cut out the details. Start decorating the package. Place the horn and the ears on top. Then eyelashes and some stars. Glue the details. The final touch is a flower crown. Wait until the glue dries and fill the package with gifts. It's so magical! Wouldn't you want to get a gift bag like this? For the next craft, you'll need a sheet of white cardboard. Draw a frame on it. Cut it out. Paint it yellow. Take some twine. Glue a few pieces on the back like this. Next, take a skein of colored yarn. Attach small pieces to the bottom of the frame. Glue pom-poms at the ends of the fringe. Decorate the upper part of the frame with cute stickers. Attach pictures using clothespins and hang the frame where everyone can see it. Let it remind you of warmer days. White slippers are so boring! Cut a small piece of a gold ribbon. Seal the ends with a lighter. Fold the piece in half and pin it in the middle. Draw a triangle on the ribbon. Sew it along the outline. Remove the pin and cut it. Turn it inside out. Fill it with stuffing. Seal the hole from the bottom. Wrap it with a gold cord. Make a second horn and start decorating it. Take some fluff. Put the horns in it and sew them to the slippers. Make eyes from a colorful sequin ribbon. Glue them. It's unbearably cute! I wish they had slippers like these in every hotel in the world! Take another piece of sparkly foam paper. Draw eyelashes on the back of a black sheet like this. Cut them out along the outline. Draw stars on pink foam paper. Cut them out. Attach a small piece of double-sided tape on the back of each part. Choose a good place on the wall and glue on your art piece. This decoration is any unicorn lover's dream! You can take so many amazing selfies in front of a backdrop like this. We'll tell you how to transform a cardboard box with wide sides. Put a sheet of shiny pink foam paper at the bottom and color the walls with gold paint. Next, take a unicorn stencil. Go over it on the new piece of foam paper on the back. Cut it out. Glue the color piece and the cardboard piece together. Make a slot in the lower part of the box. Insert the silhouette in it. Poke holes on the sides with an awl. Make holes at the same distance around the whole thing. Now, take a string of lights. Hide the wire under the edge and put the lights through the holes. They are like Christmas lights, but better! Add some more stars and let there be fun! And now, take a wooden stick. Paint it a minty color. Next, take a rectangular piece of cardboard. Glue it to a label of a room. Cut it out so that there's an arrow on one of the sides. Make signs with directions for all the rooms in your house. Glue them to the stick. Add a little unicorn decoration. Next, take a decorative bucket and colored bath salts. Pour some salt in the bottom and insert the pointer into it. Excuse me, how can I get to the kitchen? Where do you keep your snacks? Did you like our unicorn arts and crafts? Which idea will you try out at home? Let us know in the comments. Subscribe to our channel, give this video a like, click on the bell, and share this video with your friends.